can use the desktop head unit provided by Google and uh, this is an application basically an emulator of the Android Auto so you can see I have applications over here I can customize things and all I can play music from here each and everything is present so this is the Android Auto is running and uh, to actually get it working we have to have few things so let's get started so first of all you need to use the Android Studio and uh, in the Android Studio open the project or you can just go into settings Android SDK languages and frameworks and then Android SDK in the SDK tools what you need is Android Auto desktop head unit emulator you need this uh, you can also install Android Auto is API simulators so this is the thing that you need to install I've already done that uh, when you install it click uh, install and uh, it will install it for you and when each uh, when this is done then you can move forward so you need to have the Android emulator installed and then after that what you need is go into C users your user and uh, then in app data local and in here you have to go into Android then the SDK folder and uh, after that you have to go into extras Google auto and this is these are the files okay so you won't have to run this but before that what you need to do is uh, that uh, you have to open your phone from where you want to uh, from your, uh, your Android phone and then what you have to do is go into settings and uh, search for Android Auto search for Android Auto you will see this kind of an interface so what you have to do is go to Android Auto and then you have to I have this uh, developer mode on so I'll just close it and you can see over here you have um, privacy policy version so if when you click on the version and permission info you will just click on it for seven times and then you will become a developer click OK and here, there you have it uh, you can see an option to start head unit server so when you click on it you will see a notification over here head unit server is running right so when this is done now come back to your system when you have done that uh, you will see um, an option uh, to select it and uh, and click on desktop head unit server so the app is closing up right it, the application opens but it closes so to overcome this what you need to do is I'll just so what you need to do is you have to go into SDK platform tools and here you have it adv.exe open the command prompt over here and uh, paste the command adv space forward space tcp colon 5277 space tcp colon 5277 press enter okay so here you have it they will start it successfully at 5277 you can just close it go back to the desktop head units dot uh, exe file open it and here you have it you are going to see waiting for your phone uh, click on uh, accept the license accept the uh, give the permission for it and there you have it the Android Auto will start running and this is connected to your phone so there you have it thanks